removal note, you'll need a pick or pointed object to push here for the cable release of the twit from the cable. This is the location that I believe the rattle is coming from. It's the uh, passenger side tweeter. And I'm going to shake it a little bit. It does seem to be making some noise. Uh, seems a little bit excessive. I think a lot of it's come from inside of the tweeter itself. So we're going to grab it and pull straight up. Get a good grip. And there is only one cable to remove from the tweeter to disconnect it completely. And you'll want to use a little pointed object to put inside the hole for the release of the audio cable. Now let's look inside. Now with uh, the tweeter off, I can show you the rattle. We have the tweeter. And it just takes a little bit to move it. And you can see, and you can also identify the rattle just by going in here. That's exactly what I was hearing when I was driving. So the fix is to add a little bit of super glue right here. So just a little bit and that should stop it. So I'll go ahead and add that and we'll see if that fixes it. And then we'll put it back in the car and do a road test. All right, so we're gonna use Gorilla Super Glue Gel. We're just gonna put a little bit on to hold on the first tab. came out than I wanted. However, make sure it's covered and we'll let that dry. If you like this video, don't forget to hit subscribe and then click on the notification bell for more videos. All right, we're back after a few minutes of letting the super glue dry. Want to make sure it's got a good connection here. So now it's not even wiggling or budging at all. So I should take care of the rattle. And we'll go ahead and put it back in and test it out with a road test and see if it works. But uh, this should fix any problems you see with a rattle coming from like a, uh, this one I suspected from the right corner passenger side in the front. It was either the dash or something with the door. And I believe it's this uh, little speaker. So. Okay, so now we're gonna reconnect the uh, speaker. We'll simply attach uh, the wire from the door back into the port here. Okay. Simply plug it into the connection of the door. And then you're going to have to lift this up so that it can catch on the side. And it simply slides down once you have that. a little tricky. It snaps in place. Once you have that connected in, you'll feel it on the rails. We'll go right in. All right, there's just a little bit with the being in place there, but it feels pretty good. And with the much play as I found in that tweeter, uh, that's probably the cause, and then I'll go do a road test and give you my final results. All right, have an update. Did a quick drive around with the tweeter. Uh, it's no longer making any noise as far as any rattles after that fix. However, I do hear uh, one somewhere from the glove compartment area and in, in the dash, so I'll be looking at that next. But uh, the tweeter on the door is no longer making a rattle. I uh, ended up putting some 3M tape on the bottom uh, to help any rubbing and also put one behind the uh, metal uh, little hook that the top of the tweeter slides down it over so that way it also didn't have any rubbing and also made it a little tighter so that seemed to work thank you very much